Hello everybody. Today's activity is going to be another addition paper. It's going to go along with our bunnies and chicks week. So this is going to be our math problem right here. One number plus one number equals another number all together, right? So for this activity, we're going to use carrots and peas, not real ones, just paper. So what you're going to do is you're going to get a piece of paper, you're going to get a printout, and you're going to cut out a whole bunch of carrots and then you're going to cut out a whole bunch of little peas, okay? So what you're going to do is you're going to put them all together. So on one plate, you're going to put all your carrots together. And on another plate or bowl, you're going to put all your peas together, okay? And then on a third plate, you're going to make your very own divided plate. So one side, you're going to put your peas. One side, you're going to put your carrots and on the bottom it's going to be your all together equal number, okay? Let me show you. So the first one what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab two of my peas and I'm going to set them there we go, set them on one side, okay? And then I'm going to grab three carrots I can pick them up. I'm going to grab three carrots and I'm going to put them on the other side. So let me hold it and show you. So it looks like this. So you're going to put your peas and carrots, one on one side, one on the other side, okay? And then what you're going to do on your paper, you're going to go to problem number one. How many peas did you have? We had two. So we're going to write a number two in that box like that. And how many carrots did we have? We said we had three. So what plus two plus the carrots is three. So we're going to put a 3 right there, right? So there's your math problem, 2 plus 3. Now we have to figure out the all-together number, right? So we're going to take our pieces and we're going to move them down to the all-together and count how many do we have all together, right? So let me spread them out a little bit so we can count them. So here we go. Let me turn this down a little bit. So all together we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So... Our answer, 2 plus 3, is 5. So our equal, we're going to put right here, is 5. So right here, put a 5. Okay? So that's our math problem right there. 2 plus 3 equals 5. Okay? Now we're going to do that for all of these, all of these, and all of these down here. So there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 math problems you're going to do. Okay? So you're going to keep doing that. When you're all done, put your carrots back on your carrot plate. Put your peas back on your pea plate. And you're going to do it again. If you want to, there's going to be numbers in your packet as well that you guys can cut out. Use those as well for the math problems. Parents, you guys can get creative with how you use those, okay? So let's do one more just to show you guys how to do it. Let's say I'm going to take three peas this time, and I'll take four carrots this time. Okay, so here's my peas and my carrots in each side, right? So what did we have? I had pick it up. one, two, three peas. So we're going to go down to the next, next line for the math problem, and we're going to put a three right there okay and how many carrots did we have one two three four so we're gonna go next to the next number right here and we're gonna put our four okay so three plus four all together how many do we have let's count them let me move my screen again and we'll count them one two three four, five, six, seven. So all together, all together we have seven, right? So three plus four equals seven. So we're going to put a seven in that box. So that's what that math problem is going to look like, okay? And you're going to go all the way down, go to the next side, go all the way down, and then there's two more down here, okay? Moms and dads can print these peas and carrots off the website. And then you guys can use your practice, your cutting skills to cut them all out, okay? Have a great time.